Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you are new. My name is Jarelle Mata. Today we're going to be doing a makeup haul, some stuff that I wanted to share with you that I picked up at Ulta, NARS, ColourPop, and Walgreens, and I wanted to share with you before I either start using it or putting it away. So let's go on to the haul. If you are interested in seeing what I got, please keep on watching. So the first products that I got were from Ulta.com, and I actually ordered these online, and this is the Molly. I don't don't know why it has this little sticker but this one is the effortlessly airbrushed blush and highlighter so it has two little um duos like this but they're not together i wish that they were together like in a little you know compact together <laughs> and it looks like this very nice and peachy feels very very nice and soft and I don't know if you're gonna be able to see it. The blush is right here. Very nice, very peachy, very summer kind of blush. And this one is the highlighter right here. Oh, it feels really, really nice and soft. And it's a very gold tone, yellow gold highlighter. If you can see it right there. So it also comes with a brush. This one is for the blush and I guess this one is for the highlighter. I don't see myself using this brush. Um, it's just a little hard to store. Um, it feels nice, but I guess it will be nice for traveling maybe. And with that, I also got a little Molly um, Perfect neutralizer. So this is a primer. So I'll give it a, a try. And just because you purchase actually something from Molly, you also receive a gift little bag so this is pretty big this is nice feels you know like it's it's cushioning so your makeup will be nice and safe it's just rose gold it's nice it's a little nice bag all right the next thing that i got online was the i'm so excited for this one this is the Too faced chocolate gold palette and i have not even opened it yet so i'm super excited so it has this gold packaging right here with the brown like you know like it's like you just open a chocolate bar it's very very nice and let's look at the inside so it has a really nice big mirror and which i love i love mirrors and palettes i think it's amazing let me fix this right here <laughs> So before I swatch it, I actually want to take a picture of it and I know that is so annoying because you're watching my channel, but I'm so sorry. I just want to take pictures of it and I also want to put some swatches. So if you don't follow me, you can follow me on my Instagram, which is a makeup by Jarell. All of my social medias, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Snapchat, <laughs> all of it is makeup by Jarell. So yes, you can find me there. Next product that I got is the Esther Lauder and Double Wear. There was this lady in Ulta who actually worked straight from Esther Lauder that was matching people to their foundation and I wanted to get matched to mine and she matched me to the color Cashew 3W2. I am very happy that I actually picked up this foundation because everybody talks about how amazing this foundation is and how long uh, lasting it is and I wanted to try for myself because I have an oily t-zone and I wanted to know how it would perform now I am aging of course so I do have uh, fine lines around my eyes and my pores are getting bigger by the second which is so annoying but you know it comes with age so I wanted to know how that will you know like make my skin look i did try it once but i wasn't really paying attention to my skin i guess i was just more focusing on the way it make my feel a little bit tight so i don't know if it's because it's a heavy foundation that is what it's supposed to do i want to make sure that i prep my skin really 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 well before trying it again and i want to do it on a video and yeah i'll keep you posted throughout the video or in my snapchat or in my instagram story somewhere there so the next product that i got is this one right here which is the la girl pro conceal um hd high definition concealer and this one is in the shade toasted and 
I know a lot of people use this to contour, so I am very intrigued and excited to actually try this. So the next products that I got were from Anastasia Beverly Hills, and I picked up two lipsticks just because I feel like, like the lipsticks are friendlier to my lips. <laughs> I know we all love liquid lipsticks. I do too. I love them so much, as you can see right there. I do love them, but I feel like sometimes they just dry out my lips and I just want something to be nourishing to my lips and not to have, you know, like that issue of, you know, the lines showing and all of that. So anyway, so I picked up this shade, which is uh, Rum Punch. And these are matte, but even though it's matte, it's definitely not going to be as drying as a liquid lipstick. So this is the shade right here. It's just such a perfect everyday kind of winter fall lipstick. So yeah, I've never actually tried Anastasia Beverly Hills lipsticks before. I've tried her liquid lipsticks. I have several of them, but I never actually tried a lipstick from her. So that's what I wanted to do. And of course, I had to pick up a peachy nude. And this one is in the color Honey. So this is what the shade looks like. They're just gorgeous. This one's like every day, yes, you know, throw it on, put a lip gloss on top, and you are ready to go. So I picked up three shades from the Tarte, and these are new from Tarte. These are the Chrome Paint Shadow Pots, and they are very nice and pigmented. I am going to show you all of them, the ones that I have. I ordered three more from Tarte.com. They actually had a sale online um for 25 percent discount for friends and family so that's where i actually got the three three more shades i do not have them with me they should be coming but this is the shade pot of gold okay so the next shade is park avenue princess um can you see them on my finger that is so amazingly pigmented and so beautiful <gasps> that is just gorgeous i didn't think i was gonna like this shade so much but look at that reflection <sighs> okay <laughs> let me move on to the next shade shade and this one is called fire dancer and this is what it looks like <sighs> can you see that what look at that one oh so gorgeous ah! that is so beautiful beautiful i cannot wait for the other three shades to get here because i'm just going to go nuts with them i mean they are so pretty what ah oh, that's just so pretty so the last thing that I picked up from Ulta is this eye gloss from Butter London. And I was just looking actually for the tart ones and I run into this one and I never even swatched it. I am not really, I don't gr usually gravitate to this brand. I don't know why, but they do some they do have some cool products, but I just never really gravitate to them. But this one, when I swatched it, I was like, okay, this is beautiful. So this is what it looks like. So it looks like, it's like a putty kind of texture. And let me just swatch it for you. So this is in the shade Frosted. And I have it on my finger. And that is what it looks like. So it's, it feels wet but it actually dries into a powder so that is nice that is beautiful so the next product that i got is this one right here which is the covergirl peacock flare mascara this one is in waterproof i do like waterproof mascaras that's usually what holds my curls and I, I i i like it because it doesn't run it doesn't smudge and i also picked up the nyx ink liner i have the kat von d that i picked up on my last haul that i showed it to you and i want to see how they actually compare um the tip on this one it's very similar so we will see how it actually works out 
The next product that I got was from also NYX and this is this is all I got at Target and I got the Très Joli <laughs> Gel Pencil Liner and this one is in the color uh, pitch black so I am wanted to actually pick up a new black liner since I always tend to use the L'Oreal one I wanted to like you know switch it up a little bit so I picked up our lipsticks and these ones are from Maybelline Maybelline Super Stay Matte Ink lipsticks and I got four shades they are coming out with new shades um, I know that Alta.com has them but they I couldn't find them at store and I actually didn't want to pl place another order online so I'm just gonna wait for those to come in and plus I actually want to try them to see how they work out for me before I go crazy and buying all the shades and then I don't like them <laughs> so I'm going to definitely keep you posted on how I like them so I picked up this shade right here which is pioneer let me go ahead and swatch it wow they smell like candy they smell really really good so that's pioneer right here so the next shade that I got is this one right here which is called lover now the packaging is really really nice it's very matte and then the the top of it is nice and glossy so the packaging it's very very nice um they were by the way they were buy one and get the second one half off so that's why i decided to buy them um this one is lover so let me just watch it here this is like your everyday pinky mauvey tone this is a beautiful shade for every day and be beautiful Ay, they smell so good so this is the shade right here this is lover and now i went a little bolder with these two last shades right here so this one is voyager and this one is uh believer <gasps> voyager is beautiful <gasps> oh yes so this is <clears throat> this is voyager and this one is believer the next thing that I got is, of course, the Kathleen Lights and collaboration with ColourPop. This is called the Dream Street, and this is where the shades are right here. This palette is so beautiful, so, so, so beautiful. This red is talking to me in, like, a next level. This green, I mean, this greens right here are just calling my name. I also ordered the lipsticks that comes with this collaboration, but they were all sold out, so I had to wait for them to restock so I can order it. So once I get those, I'm actually going to do a whole video on this palette along with the lipsticks, just so you guys can see swatches as well as a tutorial with this palette. Of course, why not because I love it and, and the last product that I got was from NARS and I actually wanted to order from Sephora but they were all sold out so I had to order it directly from the NARS website and this is the new palette by NARS and of course another eyeshadow palette because you know Jarrell needs another eyeshadow palette so this is the packaging <sighs> just let's take a moment <laughs> That is beautiful. Oh my gosh, I had lipstick on my cheek all this time. Guys, come on. Ugh. All right, so this is the palette. If I had lipstick throughout this whole entire thing, I'm going to go nuts. I probably did. I'm so sorry about that. I just realized it. And oh well. All right. So this is the palette from NARS. This is a new one that just came out. The packaging, NARS kills it with the packaging. <gasps> this shades. I mean, oh no, these shades are so beautiful. These metallics right here are so pretty. <gasps> what? It's such a beautiful palette i cannot wait to actually use it so i have a lot of tutorials coming soon <laughs> anyway so yeah that is it for my haul i hope that you like this video i hope that you like hauls i always have hauls in my uh channel because that's just what i do this is definitely something that i'm very passionate about i love to try new makeup to especially now that i'm doing videos i get to try them for you i get to recommend new products i get to get creative with my makeup and i really 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 
really happy to have this channel and yes yeah, so if you are interested in seeing anything specifically please let me know in the comments down below if you have any questions whatsoever please also let me know in the comments down below don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i will see you next time bye